Hello, I'm Lucille Isadora Therese, and I'm your guide for this Lenten program. I'm so glad that you are joining us, and I expect that it's going to be an incredibly transformative experience for each of you. It is really a deep dive into the mystical practices of Lent, and although the practices are intensive, they are each really specifically designed to bring you closer to the deep realities of yourself, to move through obstacles, and to join in the mystical joy of Easter when that comes. So it's really worth it, and I encourage you to engage with it as fully as you can and to make the most of it. I want to give you an overview of the, of the Lenten process as it will be in this program. In this first week, you will be doing the preparatory work. So from whenever you start this program through the Sunday after Ash Wednesday, that is the preparatory period. And that's when you'll do these worksheets and watch the videos and make sure you've landed on your commitments and have a full list of the things and people that you want to forgive. It's a lot of work on the front end. It's front end loaded, but it's really worth it because if you don't set up a clear idea and commitment to what you're going to do on the front end, it's really easy for you to lose track of it, for it to kind of fall apart as you go. So the best way to meet your goals is to have clear goals on the front end. And that's why I've given you all this prep material. I hope that the worksheets and the videos are helpful. Some people do really well with worksheets on their own. They like written instructions. They follow written instructions well. If you're one of those people, you may not want to do the meditations. If you're very self-reflective and you're aware of those things which you've held resentments about and you're aware of your patterns of emotional um, self-soothing, then you really may not need the meditations. The meditations are there to help you go into a contemplative space and reflect on the questions in the in those worksheets so you can do what works for you best it may work best for you to just read through the worksheet and then just do the meditation and write down answers as you're meditating it may work best for you to do it one time with the worksheet and then do the meditation to see if you can get it to a deeper level whatever works for you the resources you'll see are right below and you can use them in whatever way works best for you after the this first week each week we'll have a morning, an afternoon, and an evening meditation. Those meditations will shift over the weeks. Every week we'll have a new morning meditation, and that morning meditation will include both gratitude and a deep reflection or contemplation on one of the characters in the Lenten story, um, Jesus, the apostles, um, Lazarus, etc. So this is a place where you can get that mystical experience of all the different aspects of ourselves in the Lenten process so that we have the fullest experience of what this Lenten story means. So those every week, those meditations will open on Saturday night before the following week. So Sundays, we'll start new meditations through the six weeks of Lent. And it'll open and you'll get an email the Saturday night letting you know that the new meditations are available. That's all you have to do. Show up, do the meditations, and do the sacrifice process that you've committed to, and and it'll it'll bring you through this deep dive of contemplation, reflection, and um, and transformation of that sacrificial part, and also the forgiveness process. So after this first week. There's only one more time that we'll do a kind of worksheet process. It'll mostly just be the meditations and your inner process. So thanks for joining. I know it's going to be awesome for each of you. And I look forward to hearing how this season has transformed hearts and minds and the things that have deeply affected the way you understand Lent and the way you understand the Christ process. Blessings and my prayers and thoughts are with you.